Coach, how has Will progressed this week, and can you share his status for the game? Uh, questionable. So we'll see where that goes, but that's where his status will be. Uh, progressed, you know, a little bit, and uh, we'll continue to work with him, and he'll continue to get treatment. Is there anything specific you'd be looking for tomorrow or Sunday that would make the deciding factor? Uh, we've discussed those, and you've been around us here for a little bit, but that would be uh, can he protect himself, can he do his job, and can he uh, make it worse. So when, when, he's looking for, when you're looking for what he can do to protect himself, is there anything specific there? Well, yeah, to be able to, to, to get out, you know I mean, move. Like, you can't just assume that by playing quarterback that you're always just going to be back there and behind the center and, you know, you, you have to be able to avoid and make quick movements and slide away from things and sometimes run with the football. Uh, and, and those are all things that go on uh, in a game. How did uh, Ryan handle the week? Good. Very good. Some excitement. I'm we talked to him over the week, but it got to be some excitement level his part to get back in there. I don't know. I'm not. Those are. I can't feel people's emotions. Yeah. So, whatever Ryan said, if he was excited, Jimmy, then. But good then, energy in practice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you know, I mean, I don't want to sit here and say how a guy feels, right. but good command. Yeah. Today we had a good day, better than yesterday, and you know that's what it'll be if if Ryan ends up starting. How good to get Caleb Farley back this week? practice, at least a, 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 maybe a start for him? Oh, yeah, a little bit of a start. At, uh, it's been a long road, and he's worked hard, and you know, really just trying to get him back out here with his teammates. I don't, there, there'll be no Caleb won't play well, I'm this year. Just a start okay. in process. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Let me, yeah. let me, let me talk to you. And he'll, he won't play this year, but he'll, this is good to get him out there and you know, continue to do the individual and see some football, and then we'll see where things go from there. And you know, that's a testament to him to, to work hard to get back. How has Traylon looked coming off the illness? Yeah, you know, I mean, that to be concerned with um, just the wind and the conditioning. And I thought today was a good day. And, and he, he's been a, a, a good pro. He's zoomed in and he's met with to, um, Rob um, a bunch, um, staying on top of those things. Because, you know, once these guys get to a certain level and there's a fever, and they, you know, we try to keep them away from from everybody else. I know that you're disappointed any time a guy has to go on IR, but especially for a guy like Nick Westbrook Aquino, who's kind of done the, a lot of the dirty work, you know, around here to to make himself a part of this team. How disappointed are you in him? Well, I'm disappointed for him and for the team. He's helped us out, and you know, he plays a lot of different roles, um, and he's continued to improve. And uh, just a very reliable, dependable player uh, that. Uh, you know, we won't have going forward. How uh, how'd you kind of manage the week? You had a couple of walkthroughs. Did you feel like you were able to get done what you wanted to get done? Or? Yeah, I mean, I think today was a little better. You know, I mean, we were able to get out here and do some stuff and just from a health standpoint and bodies. How are you looking for outs, Mike? Simmons out. McClendon out. Phillips out. Gibbons out. Murphy Bunting out. Wallace out. Hooker out. Gifford out, Farley out. Well, you know, you're on pace for a thousand yard season. It's been a while. Actually, AJ Brown was the last one. Does that mean anything to you that, that you could get uh, this receiving court back in that mark? You no, know, uh, of course that means something to me. Uh, to have a thousand yards isn't easy in this league, especially uh, when you play with you know, different quarterbacks. Uh, you know, trying to build a chemistry at receiver. It's the easiest thing, especially when it's your first year with a team. So uh, to be able to do that with two different quarterbacks, you know, uh, I feel like that's almost as, as hard. Uh, you know, as hard as going out there getting 14, 1,400 yards. What about when it comes to incentives? Yeah, I mean, you got some incentives in the contract. Can make some money with some of these statistical markers. Do you keep track of those at all? No, I don't. Let my agent do that. I just think Ryan kind of stepped back in and handled the week. Like a vet, like we expect Ron to come out with energy, uh, try to try to finish this season strong. Those of us who aren't in the receiver meetings like you are, just how important was NWI for what you guys did? How much will you guys miss him not being out there? Uh, NWI is a hard worker. You ask him to do anything, he's going to do it. So, of course, uh, you know, we're going to miss him out there, but this is the NFL, next man up mentality, and that's uh, – that's why you get guys in the offseason. Uh, that's why guys practice every day to, uh, to step up. You, you 
you've been in this situation before at the end of seasons where you with the playoff implications, where the game doesn't necessarily mean anything from a playoff standpoint, what do, you, what do you say to the younger guys or guys who haven't about playing for each other, kind of playing for, for pride? Um, you know, I really don't see it. I'm not, you know, the biggest, uh, you know, vocal person as far as, you know, trying to cheer guys up if you're in the league and, uh, you know, you need someone else to motivate you, then you might be in the wrong business. So, uh, you know, I expect everybody to come out here and do their job, no matter, you know, if we were one in whatever the, the record was. Uh, it's, 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 what you, it's what you're supposed to love to do. Is there any motivation playing spoiler because the teams you're playing down the stretch are still in contention? No. Nah, really, uh, shit, you worry about yourself. Uh, obviously, you know, you guys kind of know more about that than, than we do. Uh, but, you know, it's day-to-day -day for us, uh, and I hope that's for everybody.